Hello Sagittarius, this is Carrie from Celestial Forecasts with your 5 Minute Mini 5 Cast here. I'm pulling from three of my own decks here, so let's go ahead and get started and see what comes through. I'll link everything down below. Alright, so let's start with my Heart and Soul Love Oracle for your love connection here. Sagittarius, what is the opening message? Angels and Spirit Guides, please, for Sagittarius what do we need to know we have Bessel. okay so your lips were meant for mine no other kiss can ever compare to your kiss our kiss we have him coming through so that could be representing a divine masculine okay so let's go ahead and grab one more card here and the him card does say we are all different and unique in our own way yet we are all the same we love we live we laugh we dream, we hope, we hurt, we heal, and we cry too. Don't underestimate our soft side. We do have one and are just as weak and vulnerable as you are. Sometimes we can move mountains to be with you, make your dreams come true, and win you with our charms. All right, so that could be describing your masculine. And the masculine doesn't have to be a man. Okay, so it's energy. It can be female as well. Oh, this is interesting. Okay, so we have a divine masculine, whoever represents that energy in the relationship, they could be telling themselves lies, all right? So this for me equates to a partnership that is in separation. This card says, I'm tough, I'm independent, I don't need anyone, I certainly don't need you, your love, your touch, your kiss, none of that ever meant anything to me. My life is sunshine and rainbows each and every day. Who the hell needs the kind of love that you and I shared anyway? It's a lie, okay? They're trying to convince themselves, Divine Feminine, I feel that they don't need you. But at the end of the day, they want a second chance, okay? They want to be able to have another opportunity to be in your life. So let's grab a card from the Voices deck, which does represent thoughts of introspection from the Divine Masculine. What else do we need to know when it comes to the masculine here? Focusing on Sagittarius. I hate to admit that you really do deserve someone who can treat you better than me. Okay, they want a second chance, but they also know that they didn't treat you very well, Divine Feminine. And they're admitting that here. They're acknowledging that. All right, so Divine Feminine from the Voices 2 deck here. Let's grab some thoughts on behalf of the Feminine now. So they know that they didn't treat you very well. They have been lying to themselves. They want a second chance, though. But Divine Feminine, you're coming through, you know, still thinking about your masculine, obsessed with them. All right. So let's go ahead and grab some tarot here. I'll be pulling from my Illuminated Star Tarot, Volume 2. So you might have a masculine here who is either keeping their distance or you've heard from them and they want a second chance, but at the same time they're feeling like you deserve someone better than what they could have offered so you guys had a very painful breakup, it seems. We do have the Ten of Swords here. The relationship fell apart because they did something to ruin the partnership. They really did. And it hurt you, Divine Feminine. I feel they hurt themselves more than they expected. We do have the seven of pentacles so what your masculine is telling you here now is that they really want to let go of the past they're allowing the old cycles to phase out to complete they're telling you here perhaps they're a much better person than the one who did end up hurting you lying to you i'm kind of feeling based off of this that maybe at one point in time they really tried to convince themselves that you know they weren't very good for you. I feel there's been a shift in that energy that they have worked on on themselves, their character to come towards you as a better person. And Divine Feminine, you might have let go of this masculine because they didn't treat you right. You know, but look at these next two cards. We've got the Empress 
and the emperor so it does seem here regardless of how rocky things might have been between the two of you at one point in time they're still coming through as your divine counterpart here so give it a little bit more time i feel the masculine needs that time to be able to show you that they are now worthy of your love your heart your presence 